jacuzzi, o grana. What's the biggest challenge with this kind of surgery? I could say it's a multiple uh, challenging procedure. Many things could get, could get wrong. Even now, when three months after the implementation one of one of the stems is doing well, uh, and it's not just one surgery with an immediate final result. It's more a process. That it's called stump. It's a defect that is created after the trauma. We have a very short bone. This is it's a. Uh, not the first surgery in the world, but it's innovative and I believe that more people should try this and do it, of course, with the uh, evidence-based science behind them. It's very important. We, we uh, base our work on some uh, really good professionals in the world that are publishing some reports or giving some information how they did it. So it's a common, common um, pool of knowledge and understanding. So if we do our homework and we do um, our best in the surgery, we can give uh, more patients the chance to, to save their lives if they their multiple limb uh, damages or even why not to, to give them the, the best care possible like uh, not just living on three legs which is normal, very well accepted uh, by the way but we can even in increase the level of the, of the good animal care.